What's up guys, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and today I've got another Minecraft video for you that revolves around hosting your own Minecraft server, whether it's modded or the actual vanilla version of the game. Say that you have a server running on your local computer, if you'd like to see how to do that, check the description down below for a link on how to do that. I'm running a 1.15.1 server here, but this will work for basically any version of the Minecraft server. Say that you want some of your friends to join your Minecraft server, but you know that they don't have official Mojang or Minecraft accounts, and they're using a cracked version of the game, a cracked client or a cheating client, etc, etc. Obviously, while I'm not allowed to show you how to get a cracked client, I will be going through showing you how to let them actually join your server. So if they've tried to join your server before, they'll probably get kicked out before they can even join with an error message saying something like the server only allows official accounts or something along those lines. How exactly do you allow them to join? Well, assuming that you have your server running already, you're going to need to go ahead and stop it. So I'll run save hyphen all to save the world and I'll type in stop enter and the server will now close. Once that's done, navigate to where the server files are and we're going to be opening up server.properties. Inside of this file, we're going to scroll all the way to the bottom and we should see somewhere around the sixth line from the bottom, online mode equals true. What exactly does this mean? Well, setting this to false will allow clients that aren't verified with Mojang, Minecraft, Microsoft, etc, etc to join your server, i.e. cracked clients, cheat clients, etc, etc. By setting online mode to false, you're not disallowing anyone such as your friends outside of your home connection to connect to the server. You're just making sure that it doesn't check with Mojang if the accounts are allowed on the server. So closing out of that after we've saved it, you can simply start up your server.bat or whatever you do to normally start up your server and wait for it to start up. Now, assuming that you've set it up properly, you'll see at the very top star 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 server is running in offline slash insecure mode. If you see this line, then you'll see these ones right below it saying it will make no attempt to authenticate usernames, which is basically code for allowing your friends to connect to the server using cracked clients, etc, etc. So if they were to open up a cracked client, I've got the official version here, they can simply rejoin your server and it will work basically as per normal. However, you'll notice that if you're using an official account, you won't have a skin because it's not asking Mojang for any information regarding accounts that are joining the server. Even though I joined on my main account, TCNO, I don't have a skin, meaning that this worked properly and friends with cracked clients will now be able to join the server as you might hope. Anyways, that's about it. It's a nice quick video. It works for both modded and vanilla versions of the game. Thank you all for watching. I hope this video helps you and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.